Now, here are your latest headlines and updated Kansas City forecast from KSHB 41 News. I'm Kevin Holmes with KSHB 41 News. Here are your headlines for Wednesday, February 16th. The Kansas City area bracing for a winter storm. Nearly 200 city employees now expected to be on the roads in Kansas City overnight. All the pre-treat and plow. City leaders say despite the rain in this storm, their approach to dealing with winter storms stays the same. Aggressive pretreatment has been part of Casey Moe's strategy for this snow season. Um, we've been trying to invest more with drivers and salting in our snow plan, and so we have seen success the last couple of snow storms with that aggressive pretreatment. So it's something that we're just automatically starting to do with every snowstorm. We cannot emphasize this enough, but if you need a warm place to go, shelters will open up across the metro tomorrow, including the Roger T. Sermon Community Center in Independence. It'll open from 8 a.m. until 7 p.m. Kansas City will also open its 10 community centers as warming centers tomorrow during business hours. The city, city plans to open an overnight overflow center, too, if shelters fill up tomorrow through Saturday. Gary Lezak tracking that forecast for us. We've had some thunderstorms tonight, Kevin, and now a little bit of lightning and thunder moving off to the east. It'll all change to snow by 6, 7, or 8 o'clock in the morning, 9 o'clock in the morning, a little farther east. Accumulations of a dusting to 2 inches around Cameron northward, Chillicothe northward, 2 to 5 inches in the north side of Kansas City, and that would include KCI to Liberty, Richmond, downtown Richmond to Lee Summit to La Nostra, maybe 4 to 8 inches. So if you look at the low totals, dusting 2, 4, all those numbers are possible. Doesn't mean 8 inches of snow is going to fall, but it's possible. And the high numbers are 2, 5, and 8. So a few of you may get those higher numbers. So interesting night ahead for sure. Here are those thunderstorms that have developed. They're moving off to the east, the first little wave. And we'll monitor it closely as temperatures are dropping.